Steve Healy, radio presenter, stand-up comedian. You'll be living on 121 euros per day. Yes, I will. Why is that? Well, what we're doing is we're trying to raise awareness about poverty in the world and people living below the poverty line. And at the same time, we're also trying to raise some funds for a medical centre that we support in Cambodia. So a few years ago, I went to Cambodia and I was living there for six months doing volunteer work. And one of the things that was identified as a need was a medical centre in the south of the country. So what we did is we fundraised for this medical centre. This medical centre is now being used. It's changing a lot of people's lives, but obviously they need a little bit more help as they strive to become more sustainable so that's what that's why we are trying to collect some funds uh, during the, the, the coming days you have the luxury of uh, living on 121 per day for five days but others don't they have to spend most of their life living on that yeah. uh, meager rate what are your comments well, the thing... Will you survive it? Well, I don't know. Well, it's going to be very tough. So I know a lot of other people who are very interested in doing it as well. And one of the things we're telling people is, yes, go for it by all means. But if you feel sick or if you don't feel well, go see a doctor and stop doing it straight away. Obviously, we are lucky enough that we can do this. There are a lot of people around the world who cannot do this. So uh, the 1.2 billion people live below the poverty line. That's 2,500 times the population of Malta live below the, pov the poverty line. They do not have enough money. Um, well, they, I, don't, I don't want to say they don't have enough money, but basically they live uh, on what we're going to try to live um, over the next five days. And this is every day for them. And it's not only food. I mean, they need to get their energy costs. If they need to transport costs, if they need medicine, it all needs to come out of this. So we're very privileged to be able to live a life like we do. So it's, I think it's important that we try to understand a little bit, a tiny bit of what, what these people have to live with every single day. Will you be drinking mineral water at least? No, um, we're going to be drinking tap water. So the, uh, the idea is that you can drink as much tap water as you want. That's sort of out of the challenge. Uh, obviously in, in other countries as well, water needs to be factored in and it's a big part of it. For us, what we're doing is the 121 is on food and um, that we can drink as much tap water as we want. Who will be helping you out with this challenge? Well, we've actually got a lot of people. We've got a whole team of people who are doing it. So it's me and my wife and my parents are doing it and my sister's doing it and my, my, um, my nieces and nephews are doing it. And we've got lots of other different families who are involved. The youngest person doing it is a five-year-old. Um, so she's quite excited about it as well. The oldest person doing it is 73. So we've got lots of different people who are, who are involved and who are getting quite excited about it. You can get much with 121? <laughs> Um, I don't know, to be honest. I'm not very good at budgeting, so uh, that's that's going to be a bit of a problem. Yes, that is going to be a bit of a problem. Uh, if it was if it was up to me, if I was looking after the budget, I'd probably be completely broke after two days. So, um, so luckily uh, there are other people, like I say, like my sister, like my wife, like um, like my dad, who are much better at budgeting than me. So they're going to be sort of helping helping out and and uh, and deciding what what we should what we should eat and stuff like that. But there's obviously not not a lot of choice with 121. So we're just going to. What we so can we'll, do. we'll hop to a grocery and see what we can get. Yes, exactly. So we, we, we're just going to go and, and shop and see what we can find. Yeah. Good. Are you ready for this challenge? Five days living on 121 per day? Yes. You are? What if you get hungry? What's going to happen? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> are you aware that some children um, live under the poverty line? Yes. Are you ready for this challenge? Yes, I am. <laughs> Tell us about your menu. Okay, so um, what we've actually had to do is we've had to um, pool all our money together uh, because we've only got one euro, 21 cents. And so um, our first menu is going to be um, tomato pasta with um, tinned tomato and a packet of pasta. So that serves five people. Um, so we've got that. Then our menu for day two is going to be lentils with uh, garlic and um, Maltese bread. Uh, so that's for day two. Day three, we've got jacket potatoes with baked beans. Um, day four, we've got uh, Nana's tomato soup, uh, again with Maltese bread. Um, and day five, what have we got on day five, guys? Um, I think we either have snails, because they're cheap at the moment, and uh, Maltese bread, or what have we got? Or pasto and um, dried pasta. Is this challenge uh, foolproof? Uh, well, foolproof, I don't know whether it's foolproof, but uh, we've had discussions with the children, 
and um, you know, and many debates about what they can eat and what they can't eat. For breakfast, what are we having, guys? We're having. Uh, we are having oats. Yeah, oats. oats. And um, toast and baked beans. Yeah. yeah. Toast and baked You're not going to cheat, are you? Uh, no, no. No, they can't cheat. We're moving everything out the cupboards. And um, our fruit bowls are going to be empty. We're just going to um, get a few things. We've got oranges on the menu for a week uh, so they can have that. The biggest challenge that we have are school lunches because they have to have school lunches. So, um, guys, what are you having for your lunch, for school um, lunches? Lunch. Yeah, uh, as we discussed yesterday, um, a piece of bread. Yeah, a bread and I think honey or jam. Honey, honey or jam. Yeah. yeah. And, and when it's over, what do you intend eating? Um, stuff. stuff. Yeah, <laughs> everything. Stuff yeah, yeah, <laughs> stuff myself. <laughs>